So what's up, so fun back up today. Got a really, really, really um quick duck drive video I'm gonna do though really quick. I'm good, kind of be quiet because right now everybody's kind of sleeping in my house, so I gotta kind of be quiet. It is kind of a rare occasion where I do a video like really late at night, so kind of gotta be quiet and get up just pretty early in the morning. So um, by the time this goes up, it should be like under like maybe 11, 8, not 8 o'clock, like 11 o'clock maybe. Um, I'm gonna upload this video. But yeah, of course, I'm gonna get a new double rights banner and units that I'm ducking with from last year. And you guys know last year, we got launching, um, I think it was launching Oceanus. I would go to Peppy Gummy and do that last year. They are gonna Ducking Awaken. I think from that, you know, just like a main slow event, like where the Chi Chi and Bola, where they are Ducking Awaken, that event's gonna be back. I think it's, it likes to spread love across the universe. Where we get the Ripper here from that event, she gets in ZA. Um, we are getting those new stuff. Um, they should be getting awakenings from there. Because uh, I'm thinking, I was thinking in my head, I was like, how are they gonna awaken? How are they gonna, like, launch could use Kid Goku medals? And, um, oh, Chance could use, um, um, Omega medals. I was thinking of that, but then, then I was thinking, I was like, oh yeah, the Shattering, the Shattering Link, because all those girls, um, all do go from the Shattering Link, um, save, so yeah. Of course, I was, um, giving you a day of download, of course, so, yeah. I was like, I was like, did you give me a day of download? So yeah, this is coming pretty early, because I share these guys tomorrow at the end of the month, so almost, a quarter year old, about a quarter almost, yeah. Again, they're doing awakenings on the 13th, so by the time it goes up, maybe we'll see the awakenings already in the game. Maybe not. But of course, um, these are the news right here. Of course, launch, um, of course, launch, um, the physical one, Dead Dokken Awaken. I think he was like blonde here before, then now it's like, um, that's just really what transforming. I think he's one of the first type of youth to actually do this, where she's like transforming and stuff like that, where, um, it's her, like, like, you heard, like she's like, already, or, like, she's already like blonde hair in her SSR or but when she goes now, like, she's awakened, now she's like a transforming unit. You know, I think the Ruby does that too, because um, her SSR art is like really when she goes to transform, then she transforms into um, Ruby Ant. So, um, she is always like these one turn units, so basically, they transform into one turn. So, it's pretty good though, of course. So, basically, when she's, I think it's like when she's on the battlefield, once you have like her blue hair form, and then when she comes back the next turn, I think her hair, or, um, she'll, she'll jog, she'll auto transform. So I don't know if I'm going to upload we'll an SAM mission for them. I think I did last year. I think I did. Yeah, I think I did last year. I might do it this year. I don't know. Because I may not really update for us. She ends like that. It's her old one. They just shoot zooms on her face a lot. But yeah, I like her art though. Look, she's doing like the ho ho ho. The, um, literally, when Christmas comes down, stuff like that for me. There you go. Ho ho ho. Um, I feel like they might do it though. But yeah, um, her. Uh, yeah, she's going to do the freeze the ho ho ho. Noise. Yeah. Of course, they are working on um, Twitter. I kind of saw this kind of came up out of nowhere, and I was like, oh crap. I was thinking like a new launch because it looked like she had like, she was like SDR. But I was like, oh crap. I think you could keep the SSR and TUR, but you no, know, you cannot. Um, she um, she is um, um, physical because she she's um, awakening, so yeah. Um, again, they're pretty simple stuff like that to kind of go through it, and they didn't, it's not that much to kind of go through these guys. But yeah, again, like I said, I was gonna make, I was gonna make this video 200 years long, like I usually do like 15, 14 minutes. But I like to go into four different breaking down a lot and stuff like that for me personally. But of course, though, um, she's like going to choose to actually get transformed. So, um, yeah, I think it's like, um, she's on the battlefield first, and like that, I think she transforms the next turn. I think she comes back, or she, cause she does have an um, SD mission for her blue hair form. Then she transforms and stuff like that. So she's one of these, um, you exactly you exactly does that, which is pretty cool. I kind of like it though. Um, a unique, like, different unit though. I mean, even though, yeah, Rubrian does the same thing and the physical, you know, in, um, high school Gohan, um, for Grass Man, they like, kind of all do a similar same thing, um, and stuff like that. So, but they transform in one turn. But it's cool again. We can probably go see like a super good deal for the down celebration, do that. We can see that for, um, Buhan, um, you know, we, cause we find, we can buy Goku, he goes, um, he, he fights in, like, Blue Tanks for a little bit, then he, um, he goes to um, Ultimate Dawn. So we could see it for Down Celebration. I don't know all the like, soft people, Goku and Vegeta that fight in Kidibu. You know, like maybe like a part 2 LR or something like that. A part two, um, two, a part 2, no LR, something like that. Like Goku and Vegeta. Um, or Goku and Vegeta from Season 3, where you know, had to act as Goku and Spare Bomb or something like that. You know, you could do it with Goku or something like that, where you know, he could be like a support, like active skill unit, where like, um, like he can't active skill, where um, he gets like muscles. He's like, hey, Kakarot, you're number one. Can you take morals? I talked about Goku. Um, I mean, I mean, he more in Zara, not really Zara, but he kind of like morals himself. Not like morals, he got manga, but um, yeah. Kind of morals himself, like, hey, Kakarot, you're number one. You're nice. Yeah, of course, launch is getting your awakening on that little tangent. Of course, Oceans is as well. I do love the cards, though. They're really funny. I like it. Because that's her, like, her taunting, I think, after, I think that's her, like, taunting. I think she's laughing after, like, she hits Goku or Pan or something like that. Um, I see they should have, I should have probably up, but it actually, I don't know if she is hard, I really want to see in the game, where she's, um, or to your SSR. Like, I think she, cause, you know, all the, um, Dragon Ball, all the, um, Shadow Dragons, but she is one, um, 
I feel like it could be a category in the future. So I'm shower, maybe you have shower dragons, so I'll go with this too. Um, but like for shower dragons specifically, they can have like a free play units, they can have like ETA and stuff like that. That'd be good thing around like the Nova or something like that, like his um, red shell like form or whatever. So Nova actually has like a red shell on form, or you know, a good Nova because they didn't up on the fact that Nova was actually good in GT, like after Drake, you know, ate the Dragon Ball Swallowed it. And it was like, okay, now he's a good guy now. Please, um, this is positive energy from Goku. Because Vegeta's like, hey, he actually, act, like, yeah, he actually, he actually didn't like, act like an idiot this time. Perfect. Perfect. But yeah. Of course, though, um, yeah, like her SSR form, I know SSR, but uh, later on in the future, stuff like that, when they do, like, different card arts, uh, she should probably have, like, you know, um, because she is actually born, like, all the dragon, Shadow Dragons all born from what that the character done in the series. Uh, like she's made from the very first voice they ever did, at least she's a very strong dragon. Um, I, I, I can't really tell from here, though, because, of course, I'm, I'm zoomed out. Like, I'm, I'm all the way over there. I'm all the way over here, and you guys, like, you're probably seeing it perfectly in the screen. Her SSR, like, she could do, like, her SSR, T or R, where she basically, like, her face is, like, full on red and stuff like that, because, like, she's made for the panties wish, like, you know, some of the animation of panties wish. Like, like, that was, like, I think that was, like, the very first wish they ever did in Dragon Ball. I really want to see that art for her. So, of course, they all can go into the full details for them, though. So, yeah, um, again, though, um, super simple stuff like that, they didn't change that much for them, though. Um, dang, not sure how this freaking paragraph. Okay, yeah, because I didn't read before. Her um, move skill put the gals to keep the reaper, you know, from 20. Simple like that. She gets supreme damage, always attack and defense. Amazing. Um, a passive bit that she sneezes and transforms and stuff like that. Um, and entering the attacking time. So I guess, you know, when she's about to attack and stuff like that, I guess she transforms afterward. Um, or, you know, before you attack and stuff like that, she transforms. Could just, I guess, have her blue hair form. This has the whole, like, you know, SSR. I mean, she um, has, like, blue hair and she um, has, like, her oil. It has an S animation. There you go. But, yeah. Um, so yeah, her links are Bafo Diva, Flea, Metamorphosis, Berserker, um, Infinite, um, I'll say Infinite Dragon Ball, um, Grumbo Adventure, Guns of Dragon Ball, Sharing Limit, her categories are Pit Gauss, Show Dragon Saga, um, of Dragon Ball Saga. I, I was like, wait a minute, what? I was like, you know, she is, is that? I don't know. Pepe Gauss, Dragon Ball Saga, Earth Links, and Transformation. It's pretty good stuff. So she transformed like that, post transformation. Again, links to stuff like that never really changed for her. Again, they didn't change that much for her though. So now she has a paragraph long castle. So she did Supreme Damage, Great Lord's Attack and Defense. Amazing. That's, that's good. That's really good for her. So yeah, again, they made all the Pepe Gauss use the same. Mainly because the Pepe Gauss were viral. It's really easy to do it nowadays. Really, like, the way other can include fun. There you go. If you really want to go that route. But yeah, or like, you know, bring a Universe 16 because that has like. It has like all those characters kind of one. Peppy Gals, Rapper Growth, Universe 6, you're getting like Capital's mission done already, so I don't know, just go ahead. Like Peppy Gals and stuff like that. Again, have them stack defense, have them lower I love them to stack defense, stuff like that, attacking defense and lower attacking defense. That's how they really structure for. They're mainly for the Peppy Gals with Battle Row, I mean longer events like the Legendary Goku event. That's all these dudes are really made for nowadays. Um yeah, I guess they because he is kinda he is but I do not mean like four or five times already. I mean, that, Man, he gets, he's not. Yoi Goku's not a friend, he will destroy you with no mercy, so I'm just saying that. So he does, so she does attack defense plus 120, P3, he gets additional attack defense plus 50 percent having high chance of performing critical, um, and performs two additional attacks with the high chance of being additional, becomes a super attack, six turns from the appearance, a uh, first appearance, steals attack, super attack, and of the attack enemy if there's another Pepe Gal category ally attacking the same turn. So basically you want to use it with the Pepe Gal team. Yeah, give herself, she gave herself a lot of support, a lot of attack, a lot of defense, and stunning, so yeah, and a lot of additional, additional attack and stuff like that for her specifically. So yeah, that's how she's going to be structured for her. Really good, amazing, they made her destruct destructively good. Again, she's going to be good for like, you know, Pepe Gal, Super Battle Royale. Again, she's going to be a, like the queen for that. Um, even though, you know, they have a like, Kunta, Rosie, with Brienne and stuff like that, um, those dudes just got easy attempts long ago, but of course, yeah. But let's approach she ends, though, um, so she does um, Dragon Ball, um, Shadow Dragon Saga, ooh, nice, key 3 I think up 120, I think she did that last year as well, she raises defense for one turn, causes spring damage, good, so she does, um, speed rush of future. Um, no, we already attached, already attached, yeah. Or they could do, like, you know, what she don't she can have, like, her, uh, her true form. I think they call it, like, her, I think they call it her ugly form, I know the, um, her OCS form is, like, her princess form. She could, they could, they could do her a transformation like this. They should, they should, they really should give her a transformation, that would be awesome. Maybe they'll say that for the future, like, a transformation or whatever. For, um, through the Shadow Dragons or whatever. They should do that, though, make her, like, a transforming unit. Because she does have another true form, where it's kind of like, you know, like, a, the full on demon like kind of form though, but yeah. So she does key three, attack defense plus one twenty, gains additional attack attack defense plus sixty percent. Um it forms additional um, super attack when target's enemy is attack down status, attack or defense down status. Um attack attack defense is effective against all types, high chance of stun um high and high chance of high chance to stun the attack um enemy 
when there's a target on its seal status. So it basically last year and stuff like that. It didn't change that much for her though. So much she did that last year as well. She was really good. If the opponent was sealed, I know she had to if she had attack or defense down status, she was also good as well. So yeah, you know, giving herself support a lot, you know, a lot of good attack defense. I mean they're both amazing. Well, she's very good better than she supposed to be like one of the best units in the game. Like um the it group and stuff like that actually transforms to turn one. So her links are Battlefield Diva, Metamorphosis, Gold Judgment, um Shadow Dragons, the Speedy Retribution, um GT, I don't know why I went on that. Um, GT, Sharing Lemon, and of course, Peppy Gas and Shadow Dragon and all that. Um, I think that should kind of be limited for those two categories, though. Shadow Dragon, they, they, just, they, need, they just need to make a whole GT category in general. They need to rather just do that. But yeah, she's good, though, of course. Again, the last year she was kind of like this, but if uh, an enemy is sealed like that, um, she's gonna have a high chance to stun. Of course, she's gonna be effective against all types as well. So yeah, you know, Super Battle Road, these girls are gonna be insane. They're both insane, though, already. Like, they're both really good. Of course, this was her banner last year. Um, Right here around the time. Again, this was last year around the end of the month. So, uh, cause we got the front stuff like that. Everyone was like, oh my gosh, I launched. So, yeah, I'm um, like the very first launch in the game and stuff like that. No, it was more just like that Dragon Ball one. But it's our four, our first, first official SSR. That's where Brianna was talking about. Damn, you know, where she transformed back to the one. But, yeah. And, you know, pretty good banner. Again, last year it was amazing with Double Rates and stuff like that, but I don't recommend going for this banner. Even though it's amazing, Double Rates banners, you know, LRs and stuff like that. Even though the banner, again, all these girls are all amazing. They're all good, but I do not recommend spending for it. Trust me, if I didn't, trust me, I would recommend going for this banner. Because, you know, like, basically, if I can do play and stuff like that, you can get a whole bunch of LRs. Because if you guys know Double Rates banners, give me what damage is that. So there's only SRs and SSRs, and that's really good. Because, again, the RAs are just fodder units that no one should use. They should put all the friends and SRs that you're not awakened, put them in the, um, Turn point banner. That's all you gotta do. Do that, and every banner, like every, uh, basically like every banner, be like a uh, SR, like a double rights banner. That would be amazing. It'd be it'd be amazing for the game, so like that, people wouldn't be attacked it hard. Um, again, it'd probably because no one's gonna ever use a rare nap or whatever. No one's gonna use a rare side of me. No one's gonna ever use those stupid, ugly, horrible cards that no one ever uses. Yeah, again, those banners are amazing. I do not recommend going for it though, because down celebrations like right around the corner, like it was last year. I think. I think just go on server already confirmed pretty much at this point because you know um the countdown and stuff like that pretty much last year so it's like yeah I don't I, you know, I don't recommend going for the banner it's gonna be pretty pretty much the same like this one though but again we should see it in about a day's time as well but yeah, also I did kind of see this as well for global I mean um right here for um um survey and stuff like that this basically came after the five year anniversary as well that's kind of asking like you know it's basically just a five year anniversary update and stuff like that it's kind of going on it's like okay it's only for the mobile version we can only do it for mobile i think last year i think people could do it on the computer and stuff like that i tried to find it i couldn't go but yeah a lot of people were going on like yeah um because like, this actually survey does feature it's like do you want dragon ball this survey i want to mention it has, it has like um features like oh yeah do you want to see dragon ball heroes units and joker fest at large so why they do want like more collabs what was the good thing about having anniversary again this is a big five-year anniversary survey overall which is really good i can know uh, basically almost kind of confirming this i guess maybe they're like okay maybe let's wait until global because it, again, it just came out for a few months ago again i'll leave the video somewhere right here in the old oceans video and stuff like that i'll leave all right here somewhere but yeah i was just like last year when this came out i was like i could i did do a video for it i was like holy crap i think it's like a 20 30 minute video i did for that or i think it's like 10 minutes i think i can't remember i remember 10 minutes or whatever 10 to 11 minutes yeah, and I was like, holy crap, this is actually really good. So maybe they were kind of waiting for Global, because JP already had this. Maybe they, I would think it's like, maybe they're kind of waiting for Global to kind of um, go for this. He's like, okay, let's kind of, they're like, okay, let's kind of wait for Global right now. Let's kind of wait and stuff like that. Let's kind of wait. Um, make sure you guys get it first and stuff like that. But yeah, again, I do recommend going for a survey and stuff like that. Free stone and stuff like that. But yeah, again, the probably anniversary was really good though. Um, I only didn't want to say I didn't really like content like that. But yeah, I mean, Global didn't really even cool down because we just put right in the Kepler. But yeah. Again, though, the story we'll go today, again, though, get some good stuff for Oceans and stuff like that, with their awakenings and stuff like that are really good. Again, they're really amazing units and stuff like that. Like, this, um, day down and stuff like that was really good. Um, these, again, these are all units and stuff like that. Again, all, this is a really good update. Launch is amazing. She's insane. Oceans is insane. Um, the Global got the 5 year anniversary um, survey and stuff like that. Again, make sure to do that. Just your and stuff like that. Again, give you input, give you output. They want to hear this type of thing. They're like, okay, they, again, they just want to hear this type of thing. They want to hear what you guys want to say. They want to hear your voice and stuff like that. Of course. But yeah, gonna go ahead and video here um before i get too loud or whatever i get right into the video i was like oh my gosh but yeah really good update that we're getting we should see in about a day two a day so yeah i'll upload this video as soon as i can but yeah see you guys later though thanks for watching have a great day but all cool junk again though what do you guys think about this update what do you guys think about that game it looks great awesome love it global survey make sure to do that as well good um update cards this time around for um jp stuff like that again we had this like kind of like last year and we all speculated they were gonna get away from anyway because the banner came back i was like wait a minute they're bringing this banner back and i was like oh yeah they're gonna get away um, everybody was thinking that, but yeah, 
Um, I mean, yeah, the same time they all make the guys' cars really thick, because I see one just like everything down there. And I see her Nikes down there as well, her Nike 11s. Um, I'll say the UV 11s, and of course, you know, we see how she ends up full. I can they'll make the Peppy Gals cars super thick and stuff like that. But yeah, we're really gonna end the video here before I get way too long in it, because I do love doing videos like this, going full out breakdown. But I know I'm gonna do ultimate talking breakdown for Legends and stuff like that. I'm gonna get the video out as soon as I can. It's up the Turtles one, as up the Goku Blue one, the Vegeta one that's having to upload it yet. I have this video ready to go, I have not uploaded them yet. So yeah. We're gonna end the video here. See y'all there again though. Peace out.